Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. Uh, let me change that. I am going to show you how to set any program to the system tray. So a program that I use all the time when listening to music is Pulse Effects. It's an excellent audio tool. Uh, it lets you tweak the way your sound, you know, you can tweak your bass, you can tweak your auto gain. Uh, my Corsair headset that I use on Linux is pretty quiet for some reason. Uh, you know, not when I'm listening to like videos and stuff, but when I'm listening to music, it's kind of quiet. So I have an auto gain and I use an equalizer to make the music sound better. And, uh, you know, it's nice and it, but it has to be running all the time for me to use it. And, you know, when I'm doing a lot of stuff on the screen, I, my taskbar gets cluttered, you know, it's all filled up and then I have this. And if I minimize it and I accidentally close it, then my sound effects go away and I have to reopen it. So this is the perfect program to show you how to send it to the system tray. So to start off, you need to make sure you install the KDocker program. And information on how to do that is in the link in the description. Once you do, you can just search for KDocker, launch it, and then just click on the app you want to send to the tray. In my case, it's going to be Pulse Effects. And as I do, it's right here in the tray. So we can see Pulse Effects is right there. And now I can just click on it here, and I can access it. At any time, I can do what I want to do with it, and then I just minimize it, it's in my system tray, and I can even hide it, because you know XFCE lets you hide certain stuff in the tray, and PulseFX is always running, I know it's there, and uh, at any time, like I said, I can just open it up. So, pretty cool, right? So, quick video, hope you guys like it, but uh, just how to send any program to the system tray on Linux. I'll see you guys in the next video.